Hey, believe it or not, Ripley's is amazing. People once again. Hey, from bizarre facts to amazing achievements, the new book is filled with strange things that will leave you in awe. David Martin is checking it out. He's live this morning at Ripley's, believe it or not, on International Drive. Hi, David. <laughs> Hello, Amy. Hi, Bob. 14 years now, Ripley's has put out a coffee table book like this. This one is now called Shatter Your Senses. 1,500 new stories. Everything in here you've never seen before. Sabrina Seek does some of the research for the book. How are you, my friend? I'm great. How are you? What a great project for you. How fun is this? It's so fun. Every year, you know, we find a bunch of stories from all our contributors around the world and also get some really great exhibits, which we're excited to show you guys. <laughs> some of them are frankly gross. We'll let you discover them here yourself. But these are not gross. These are beautiful. What are these ladies holding? These guys are holding um, some rose petal portraits made by Ricardo Amusca. He's a Mexican artist, and we have about 15 in our collection. These are some of my favorites. So those are made out of rose petals? Absolutely. Boy, I'd love to have him commission one for my wife. How beautiful is that? All right, what's next here on the table? We now have a chicken wire sculpture made of a bull terrier. It is actually made of over one mile of chicken wire. And you know that because it started out as a one mile, and did he put it together like that, or does he just measure that? How does that work? It started out as a mile, and most of them are about that same size, so we can oh. measure it that way. A mile? Yeah. <laughs> All right, what's next on that table? Moving down the line, we also have some butterfly um, portraits of the masters and different paintings. They're painted on butterflies by artist Christian Ramos. He Where's also, he from? He is from Mexico. He also does tarantulas. He made a spider web dress, a lot of crazy things. I thought he seemed familiar. Yeah, we had a cockroach, I think, done by him last year, but he's done butterflies. He's softened it a bit. I like that. Right. <laughs> All right, very good. Oh, what's on that book there? That looks kind of gross. We have an Egyptian mummified hand. It's about 3,000 years old, and you can see the wrappings on there, even some fingernails. I uh, don't really want to touch it. it. Might be cursed for life. Yeah, indeed. <laughs> and what's on the table behind it? We have a inflated animal head. It's by an artist named Solozi Geza. He's from Hungary, and what he does, he takes the animal hide and kind of wraps it around like a balloon. He also made this taxidermy foosball table, which is probably one of the funniest things we've ever seen. <laughs> Hamster versus squirrel, that's a party favor right there. That's a talker, no question about it. All right, so this is all inside the book. It's a tiny, tiny, tiny fraction of the 1,500 items inside. Shatter your senses. Where can I buy Shatter Your Senses starting tomorrow? You can buy it at all major booksellers like Amazon, Walmart, and Barnes and & Noble. And it costs the retail value there? $19.99 in our auditoriums. Number 14, Bob and Amy, I know you have 1 through 13. Where do you keep them? On your coffee table? Back to you. Yes. <laughs> I do.